got one here which could take a little bit of time. It's from Hanson on Twitter. It's your starting eleven, your England starting eleven for the first Euros game. Bloody hell! Excuse me, this will take a long time. <laughs> give us a couple. Of, give us a couple of your bankers there, maybe if not the full eleven, Jamie. Give us a, two or three of your bankers. Well, you, I'm so. What, okay, let's go. Let's go to the important players. I think John Stones hitting form is the best news that Gareth Southgate does. I don't like how we look to be pre him finding this form. I was a little bit worried about us defensively. Now, how do you match that up? He looks like he wants to play over back three. You know, you look like going with. Um, with with maybe Harry Maguire. He's gone with Kyle Walker as well. The interesting ones that we do go over back three is the wing-back situation. Like Trent's not played well this year and he's not a wing-back. So he comes under pressure from um, Reese James. Left back, left wing-back situation, I think if we do play that way, I think the fact that um, Chilwell's playing so well in that, sit- to, that system for Tuchel really helps Gareth Southgate as well. But now it certainly gets interesting because... Jordan Henderson might miss out, it looks like, because of this groin injury. And, and I think they won't rush him. As much as it's important he plays for England, he's got, you know, he's coming into an important time of his career. He wants to play for his country. He's obviously proud to, but if he's not right, he's not right. So then it maybe feels like you're going to go with um, uh, Declan Rice is a, is a banker then. Maybe does he then play with Mason Mount in, in, alongside him? That could be a situation where you've got, you know, super talented players. Up front, it's so difficult. Harry Kane obviously starts. Then you've got Marcus Rashford and you've got Foden. Uh, I think Marcus Rashford's got to do more right now. I think he's a, he'll definitely start, but he might be the one player that comes under pressure if he doesn't score goals and 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 do as well because people there will be a clamour for you know for Foden or for Sancho. Sterling's definitely going to start as well. So there's a there's a lot of you know people looking for that position. I want to see Grealish play. But right now, it looks like I've picked 13 aside. So it's hard for me to pick it, Chris. So I don't know, or, or Neil, I'd, so I don't even know how difficult it's going to be for Gareth. You know, Harvey Barnes has been in great form. Har- Harvey Barnes, until he picked up this injury, is one of the best strike. You know, his, his numbers, his goals and his assists were as good as anybody's. So it's incredibly difficult. I just don't want to see Gareth play safe, though. I want to see him go over a really attacking team. 